Go on. End it. End it! What's stopping you? Oh, I forgot. Barry Allen is above killing. Isn't that right? Get out of here. I wonder what face I'll be wearing next time we meet. Flash. Can't wait. What is good YouTube, what's you here? If you're into The Flash Season 5, this is the channel for you, so make sure to subscribe. So recently there's been some updates on casting news about Ralph and Cecile. They've been upgraded to season regulars, which has surprised the internet a lot, to be honest. Not so much Cecile, because obviously she's had Joe's baby, so now she's part of the family, and obviously the baby's going to be centric to what I believe a future storyline will be involved this season when they go to the future where Nora Allen's from, and it's going to have something to do with the baby, because obviously what she said to Cecile before the baby was born, and it was such an important time, and you should cherish a moment with your loved ones. But that could be kind of cool, but we'll talk about that if that happens. And Ralph Beck getting upgraded was a bit of a surprise because they said that about Tom Felton, Julian Albert, and then he kind of got wrote off just saying he went back to England. But I want to focus on what I said about the reverse flash returning in my most recent video due to Nora Allen. So I'm just quickly going to go over them details. We don't know if it's true or not, but let's just say it's a theory for now. So Nora Allen is called Rewind and comes from a future where Barry's disappearance in Crisis on the Infinite Earth led to war, led to a war between the humans and Metas, which she hopes to prevent. She is chased by a time-traveling bounty hunter known as Pursuit, who I said in a recent video is most likely Hot Pursuit. And it's interesting because it's her brother, Barry's son, which is pretty cool that plays out. But it also said Ebar Thorne returns for a multi-arc story centered on Barry's children in the second half of the season. And it's going to be played by Tom Cavanagh and Matt Lenchester. So that sounds like a pretty cool season alone, having them characters back we know the reverse flash returns back every single season and the last time we seen him he said i wonder what face i'll be wearing next time you see me so that happened during the crisis on the infinite earth sorry the crisis on earth x episode like the multi like the four episodes which that happened on interesting enough nora allen was in that so we know he were we he will reappear because obviously in 2024 the Flash and Reverse Flash have a fight. Then Barry goes missing. So the last time before we seen him then was actually on Legends where Black Flash sent him to the Speed Force. And a lot of people are confused thinking that he died. But no, when a speedster dies, essentially they go to Speed Force until they can get out. So the question, question isn't if he's going to return. It's going to be how and when. So what I want you to do, guys, is let me know how would you get him to return? Who would you want to play him? Would it be a new actor? Would it be Tom Cav? Would it be Matt Lenchester? I know Matt Lenchester is on a Netflix show, but I'm pretty sure they've wrapped up film with that. So part of a multi-arc story centric around Barry's children would be pretty cool and it would make up for a pretty epic crossover. Seeing as we didn't really get any crossovers last year, okay, yes, we got the one on Earth X, but let's be honest, guys, it wasn't very good and there was no Grid of God one. I mean, we usually get Grid of God two-parter, so it would be cool if they could bring Reverse Flash and Grid of God together as part of a storyline. That would be pretty cool. So when would you bring Reverse Flash back? Um, I really am interested to know what you guys know obviously reverse flash is centric to the whole show it started with barry allen's mother being killed so if you read dc rebirth they're currently doing a pretty cool storyline which is flash wars which came out this week where they've been doing it for a couple of weeks and it's going to continue it's pretty cool it's centered around obviously wally west African Wally West and Ginger Wally West and Ebar Thorne himself and essentially it's Barry Allen going up against Wally in some sense so in this story Ginger Wally West has lost all his memories he's trying to remember about his kids Jar and Iris who um, Ebar Thorne essentially tricked him in some sense um, Ebar Thorne who's lost his own connection to the speed force he tells Wally that in order to get all his memory back he has to break the speed force but in order to do that, he needs Barry Allen's help. But obviously, Barry Allen's not going to want to help him. So Wally said, I will make sure you will never run again. And then it ends with Barry chasing him. So will Wally West ever remember everything? Which is kind of interesting. Because obviously, this version of Wally West, Ginger Wally West, has been popping up quite a lot throughout the whole 
48 issue of the actual comics. But something similar happened to this on The Flash Season 4 during Episode 15, the kind of Flash Time episode, when Barry wanted to throw the bomb into the Speed Force and Jay Garrick told him no this will have massive consequences for all the speeders throughout the multiverse so i presume that's going to have some massive consequence if he does break the speed force in the sense in the comic books but it's very interesting how they both have similarities in the same kind of context in the same year which is kind of interesting so guys let me know are you reading flash wars it's so hyped i hope godspeed returns because you can't have a flash war without godspeed is godspeed going to turn up on the flash tv show well, maybe because everyone wants that to happen. And how is Reverse Flash going to return when he does return? Because we do know he's going to return. I will be doing a video on the Flash movie updates probably today or maybe tomorrow because that movie looks like they will be shooting it in 2019. But saying that, it was already supposed to be out by now. So we can't believe anything until we get proper information most likely at Comic-Con. So anyway, guys, please like, subscribe as always. And I will catch you in another video very soon guys catch ya later